What's up, y'all? It's your boy Dead the motherfucking zombie back up in this bitch with a new fucking video of a bunch of pictures and um, just my raspy ass voice. Um, I was thinking about this. Oh, I announced in my last live stream that I would be doing a video about Straight Jacket. Um, I'm at home right now, but I do have a hard copy of his album Closure. And, uh, I was on a site called deadanddirty.com, which is like an underground juggalo record label where groups like uh, Dead Dirty Carnies reside and uh, um, DBA, fucking, that's where Stray Jacket was once signed. And on their site, they have some, a bunch of albums up for free download. They might need to fix those because uh, some of them don't download. That sucks, but anyways, um, some of Straight Jacket's me music was on there, and I downloaded uh, the two Along the Road albums, which are like um, his Forgotten Freshness albums, and I've been giving them a list of my favorite tracks, or uh, mainly from the first one. Um, those are, those are Nuclear Nuclear Sunshine original version and. Um, in the song called Why. Um, on uh, the songs like Nuclear Sunshine, he paints like a very dark, vivid picture of like the apocalypse and shit. And also, it gives me Fallout vibes. Like, if you're a Fallout fan, you will love this fucking song. Um, the chorus is catchy. Even my little brothers dig that song. And, uh, man. And, Straight Jacket, if you guys didn't know, is the new signed in engineer at Psychopathic. This guy engineers, he produces, I'm sure he mixes and masters, and he raps. He's good at rapping. And on, the tra on tracks like Nuclear Sunshine, the beats, they're mesmerizing. And, fucking chorus, man. How can I be okay if I'm gonna die today? Oh man. Like, I'm thinking, uh. Like, since he's like the new science engineer, he's technically on Psychopathic's roster. I think he should drop like an EP or an album or even help put together a mixtape because the guy is awesome he is dope as fuck i've been listening to his back catalog um i have his album closure ripped on my mp3 player um i got one of those little phillips mp3 players it's good shit i fucking love this thing and uh you know his music's awesome and he's been a big part of my recent playlist um i got even some of his work with uh, Dead Dirty Carnies. And uh, this guy's also got a track with ABK called The Last Warriors. I can't play it, obviously, due to copyright reasons. But, yo, it's awesome. This guy is very fucking talented. To me, he's better than Young, young Wicked, Young Dickhead. Um, and, like, the guy could tell a very good story. The guy also makes fucking good smoking tracks. Like his tracks, the track um, blunts on the fucking table on his closure album. It's fucking awesome. Everybody kills it on that fucking song. Him and Smokehouse Junkies, motherfucking some good shit. And uh, you know, tr his darker tracks like the the Seeker from one of the Dead and Dirty Goodie Bag albums. Um, even like like my personal favorite album of his is his Nuclear Sunshine album. Like on here, I guys out uh, uh, his albums till death, both along the roads, crossroad and freaks. But uh, I, I have his pretty much his entire back catalog up in my storage, cloud storage right now. And like like he had these out all out for free download, except for closure obviously. So I'm like, who fuck it. So uh, I stored it all, all, all the way, so we'll see. Um, but yeah, my thoughts is like if he could like drop an album 
we're gonna like do a couple features with some psychopathic artists. And there, I know, I think he did some work for Big Hoodoo on his Asylum album. And there he sounds fucking pretty on some songs, like running for my magic. Yeah, it's good shit. Um, like you know, I'm probably gonna use like a bunch of pictures of his album covers and shit. I like the pictures of this video and some of his pro promos with Dead and Dirty Productions. Um, they had a bunch of side pro projects back in the day. Um, one of them was called Madhouse Rejects, and I think he was part of that. I'm not sure. But uh, all I know is Madhouse Rejects. Um, if any of y'all are, are watching my fucking um, videos, make a Madhouse Rejects album, dude. You know, you've only got like four or five songs on and they're all dope. Come on, man. But, uh, yeah. So, Straight Jacket. It, he's gonna shine well on Psychopathic. So, in my opinion, he should at least be featured on a couple songs as, you know, another guest. Cool as fuck. And, uh, I think he's also gonna be doing, like, some production work, too, so. You know, this year's albums look like they're going to sound good. And, uh, well, that, that's all I get. I, I, I got to say on this. Um, as I'm uploading this video, I'm going to be getting ready to live stream it. Here in a little bit, right? So, see you then, motherfuckers. And, uh, yeah, peace.